Traditionally, a vegetarian diet involves avoiding eating any meat. The earliest records of vegetarian diets come from India and ancient Greece. The idea behind the Indian diet was to avoid any violence towards animals. Ancient Greeks had a similar philosophy, but it was also considered a way of keeping the body clean and pure. Nowadays, there are many kinds of vegetarians, and sometimes it's difficult to keep up with them. An ovo-lacto vegetarian is someone who doesn't eat meat of any kind, but eats dairy products and eggs. The term comes from the Latin ovum, which means egg, and lac, which means milk. In the Western world, this is the most common kind of vegetarian. And more often than not, when someone says vegetarian, they mean ovo-lacto-vegetarian. There is a huge amount of food in supermarkets and restaurants which is suitable for ovo-lacto-vegetarians. A pescatarian is someone whose diet includes fish and seafood, but no other meat. A pescatarian is not technically a vegetarian, and this diet is often used as a stepping stone for people who eventually plan to become vegetarians. A pescatarian diet is full of omega-3 fatty acids, which is necessary for good health. Pescatarianism is a new term which first appeared in 1993. Many pescatarians, like vegetarians, believe it is wrong to eat meat although they don't believe that killing fish is as bad as killing other animals. A similar diet is followed by politarians, but instead of fish, the only meat they eat is chicken. A vegan is someone who doesn't use animal products in any form. This means they don't eat meat or dairy products, and in some cases products like honey. Some ethical vegans also avoid wearing clothes that are made from animal products like leather, wool, and even silk. Raw vegans have an even stricter diet and don't eat cooked meals. They believe that cooking food destroys the balance of nutrients that food has. A vegan diet is believed to be too extreme because vegans miss out on important nutrients. However, as long as they are careful with their diet, there is no evidence that vegans are unhealthier than other vegetarians, and in fact, they even enjoy less risk of developing heart disease. A flexitarian is someone who is basically a vegetarian, but occasionally eats meat. Generally, people are eating less meat, and the main reason for this is because they are becoming increasingly aware of the negative impact meat production has on the environment. For example, 70% of the Amazon rainforest has been destroyed to make way for cattle farms. Apart from the health benefits, and perhaps more importantly, being a vegetarian is good for the planet. And anyway, you don't have to be a vegetarian to love vegetarian food.